Hello guys welcome to celebrity news and lifestyle where we give you the right update and all of what you will like to know so if you are new here if at all you're just passing by for the first time please take some minutes of your time to subscribe like comment and hit the notification button so that you don't miss in any of my uploads. US Virgin Islands seeks 190 million dollars in Jeffrey Epstein sex trafficking suit US territory claims Chmulban Chase covered up Epstein's crimes while the bank claims it is being protected by Virgin Islands officials. Hold up Jeffrey Epstein's sign in federal court in New York City on July 8, 2019. Epstein is reportedly charged with one count of conspiracy to traffic in children and one count of conspiracy to traffic in children. It has been nearly four years since former financier Jeffrey Epstein was found dead in a New York jail cell after being arrested for sex trafficking. But according to officials at the New South Virgin Islands Bank, Morgan Chase knew of Epstein's activities well before his arrest and allowed him to abuse victims at a resort it owns on the territory. The allegations were first made in a lawsuit filed last year that the bank should have known about Mr. Epstein's illegal activities at a mansion on Little St. James Island, the New York Times reported last December. Described by The Independent as a Zen-style retreat with 70 uniformed staff, this mansion is said to have had an enviable guest list over the years, including Epstein's client and confidant Prince Andrew, model Naomi Campbell and actor Kevin Spacey, comma comedian Chris Tucker and physicist Stephen Hawking. Guests arrived by private jet, the same mode of transportation that was later renamed the Lolita Express. Because the same planes would have transported of Epstein's victims to and from the island. Morgan knowingly, negligently and illegally provided and operated the levers used to pay recruiters and victims, and was essential to the operation and cover of Epstein's human trafficking firm, the lawsuit says, citing a 2020 release civil suit filed against Epstein's estate. In this lawsuit, which was settled for $105 million, the use the Virgin Islands describe an elaborate plan that involved looting territory to allow Epstein to continue his rampant behavior. Epstein was a client of J.P. Morgan Chase from 1998 to 2013, when the bank said it had ended his relationship, five years after the disgraced financier was convicted of soliciting a teenager into prostitution in 2008. The bank eventually agreed to a $290 million settlement with a group of Epstein's alleged victims, who also said the financial institution must have known about his actions, particularly since he remained a registered sex offender. After the case was filed in a U.S. court on Friday in 2008, the Virgin Islands said that in addition to securing a multi-million dollar payout, J.P. Morgan Chase should investigate the root causes of the bank's failure in its banking relationship with Jeffrey Epstein and identify missed opportunities to expose his criminal activities. CNN reported. Thanks for watching to the end, and guys, don't forget to subscribe comma like this video share and leave your comment on the comment section below your comments matters see you next time